here, uh, episode three, verse, bridge, chorus, middle. And I'm using from Living the Dream, the song Knocking at My Door. I'm gonna play the song, the actual song, and I'm gonna play along a little bit, and I'm gonna shout out all the sections, verse, bridge, chorus, middle, etc., while it's playing. So it's a much quicker way of you getting an understanding of how it's laid out. Um, after the intro, there's a little hooky bit, like a twin lead, guitar keyboard lead, <coughs> which I call the hooky bit, because it catches your ear. And it pops up a second time during the song. I'm not saying where, till it comes. So, knocking at my door, here we go. All right, boys. again so coming up now. Go on Dave. A little bit of a wild wild coming up.
Well done, lads. Thank you for that. So, there we have it. Um, so those are all the parts. I've explained where they came, so you can see. The other thing about melody in the song, as like most songs, is um, you kind of step step the vocal range, so you're not peaking too high, singing too high register in the first part of the song, like the verses. And you, you tend to work around the middle range of a, a singer's voice. But this is not everybody, this is just what we tend to do in Heap. And, um, and work up the bridge, which leads you into the chorus, and you're stepping up all the time, and the vocal gets more powerful. And so you get a movement that way, a, a curve which takes you on a journey, as opposed to something linear which doesn't move. So that's for that's the kind of construction for melody that we use. And the idea of the lyric, knocking on my door, was just imagine a paranoid person and how awful it must be to be in that position. Thank God we're not. Well, some of us are, some of us aren't. <laughs> um, what do you reckon, Jesus? You see, he doesn't always pay attention. He's always looking in the wrong direction. Unlike Santa, who is, of course, looking at the view. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, next time, we'll be dealing with another song from that album, perhaps, or maybe somewhere else. I don't know. I'll decide where we're going on the next episode, but it'll be fun. See you later. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.